Hey everyone, uh, so it's been a while since I put up a video, um, but uh, I had a buddy give me some Marty Stewart stuff that I hadn't heard, and I sort of flagged this tune, uh, and I put it in a folder, and I went back and listened to it, and I was like, oh, that's a really nice little break. So, uh, it's Wheels, it's Marty Stewart. Uh, I'm going to try to figure out who the steel player is. Maybe I put it in the description. If not, someone let me know. And um, But it's a cool little solo. It's just over the second half of the solo break. And it's basically just over a one and a four and a five. Hope you enjoy it. Okay, guys. So uh, this just goes over like a one, four, one, four, and then up to a five. So uh, here's how it goes with the chords. One, four, one, four. Five, one, back up to the five. Okay, let me bring down the gain here a smidge. Okay, so here's how the solo goes. something pretty close to that. There's a bunch of different ways this could be played. So uh, I'm gonna show you how I play it. So uh, it does that uh, first, and it's just going. Or, so that's just on our A, B position. That's our uh, G sharp or A flat, whatever you wanna call it. Uh, grabbing four and five, bringing in the A, starting with it off and pulling it back off and then just down uh, that's just uh, six seven six so four and five six seven six that's all with the B pedal still on this wide angle I'm not or without the wide angle I'm not sure if we get the feet but we're gonna try this this camera once does the same thing when it goes up to the four we're going up to the um, 16th fret Literally the exact same phrase. So the first two over the one, first one and four is. Okay, and that sounds like this. Sorry, it sounds like this. Okay, now we get to our next little phrase. There's a bunch of ways to play it. I would kind of play it like this. Uh, going from to our A and F position here. And it sounds like we could be doing three strings, but he's, I think, just doing these two. So it's just on four and five. That's uh, raise your E's, your F lever. Uh, okay, so then I would go up to my A and F here. So we're going. That's on our uh, one chord there. So we're going to, uh, that is the 15th, 17th, 18th, 19th fret. Raise the E's, put the A bow in. That's four, five, four. Down two frets, same thing. Same knee levers and pedal. Then release the F. And that's four and five with just the A. Four and five with just the A down on the 14th fret. So that sounds like this. Now it goes to the four chord. Bunch of ways to do this, but I would go up back up to the 16th fret, put in the A and B, and we're doing five and six. Uh, uh, yes, so, sorry, seven and, <laughs> yes, uh, six and five, exactly. Oh boy. So uh, first one is, then I put the A and B down, go back up to the 16th fret. And that's, uh, uh, that's uh, six and five, so that's going five, six, five. Then I would release them both. Okay, and that's just uh, release them both. Go down to the 14th fret, no pedals, and then come back up here, and we're gonna go. 
Uh, so we're going, uh, let me hear exactly that phrasing. Yeah, so, so that's, uh, I'm just naturally putting down my B here, going, Bring it in the A, then to the fourth string, and then no pedals. That's uh, six and five. And then we go down to back down to our eleventh uh, thread. And then again, let me hear the phrasing. Sorry, I just learned this. Yeah, so. So we're going uh, down here, same thing, bringing in the A. I've got my B pedal down, but bringing in the A. Uh, six. <laughs> I already forgot the phrasing on that, it's kind of fun. So, oh. so that's with the B pedal down, bringing in the A, six, B pedal down, that's all the B pedal down, just going back up, four, three. Uh. I, I released that the timing of this is cool and then I keep forgetting it, but we're kind of going Releasing that into our five chord and as we do that we're starting with a, th a three grip thing And that's open two and three and then four. I'm sorry three and four and then five Same thing down two frets, but I put the a pedal on Then I come back up I play uh, four and five. That's with both pedals down. And then I play four and five and I rock the A on and off. And then I, I drop the E's and hit four and five again. That's how I get it. You could go back up here with the A and B, but it's, I think it's faster to go. And let me hear that phrasing again. Yep. So. You can listen to it for exactly the timing, but that's basically it. And then he comes down. And that's just, uh, that is just six and five. Just kind of rocking both of them on as we're going from the one to the five and then he slides up to there back up to our open this is all over our five quarter a little turn around to the 11th fret same two strings and then I think he might walk up but uh, I'm not gonna figure that out right now so the whole thing if I can remember it but I just learned it is uh, up that five but that's the idea cool little solo some really cool little moves there alrighty hope you guys enjoy it